baby, don't waste my time, waste my time, waste my time. Money always on my mind, on my mind, on my mind. I'm always thinking about babe. Hey, what's up? We about to get it. And turn up, got it. And turn up. Hey, what's up? How are you doing? It's your girl, Abby Nicole. What's up, AB Squad? Today, I'm here with another hair video. Um, you guys, this hair color didn't come out what I wanted it to be. I'm gonna tell you this right now, but I guess it's working. Um, I'm gonna give my hair review, so if you wanna see the specs on this hair, what I did, what color I used, then please keep on watching. Okay. Okay. my Wiggins hair and this hair came in 613 I got it in the lengths I got a 20 inch frontal a 20 inch bundle a 22 a 24 and a 24 and this is what I got I am five foot eight five foot nine and the 24 comes by my waist this is honestly a little bit long for a 24 I mean I kind of sewed it like on the I sewed it on like the very bottom of my cap so that's probably why Oh, and just letting you guys know, this shirt is on my website, so you can purchase, motivate, innovate, inspire. It's just a quote or words that I really love, and yeah, so I'm just going to cover it now. So you guys, um, I have this hair sitting here for a while, honestly, and I apologize to Wiggins Hair for that. I just have been so busy, and I just didn't want to just have platinum blonde because I have platinum blonde already. So with that being said, I, as you guys know, I just did the pastel pink, and I was kind of in a pastel mood, and after I saw, again, my girl Crystal Marie Vargas, she did this, or she has a wig like this, but it was cut in a bob, and I'll post a picture right here so you can see it, um, I was like, yo, I want this, I also saw Time the Infamous with this kind of bluish pastel blue color, and I was like, I want to do that, because I really like how the pastel pink looked at me. I'm sorry you guys, this hair is really soft to the touch and I just can't stop touching it. Anyways, um, so today I literally woke up and I was like, I'm getting that color. I'm going to do the Royal Blue Roots. Royal Blue is my favorite color. As you know, sorry, let me take the glasses off. Sorry, you guys. Royal Blue is my favorite color, as some of you guys may know. So I was like, let me do the Royal Blue Roots. I was going to do an ashy root like I did for the, the pastel pink wig. But then I was like, you know what, let me just do something different. And literally just do this so I really kind of like how it came out I honestly want it to be more like a sky wider blue like a white blue and it came out more like a I don't know what would y'all call this color I'm not too sure um, I guess it's sky blue but I wanted more like a icy white blue if that makes sense so what I did was I um, use sky blue and adore hair color and I literally put so much conditioner in it because I didn't like the swatch of the blue that it had it was really it was more blue it was like baby not baby blue but it was just like a weird blue that I just didn't like and so I was just like you know what let me dilute it with conditioner and I used so much conditioner you guys it's not even funny I used the suave conditioner and then I used the indigo blue that I have my indigo blue wig the royal blue wig on the top and that's pretty much all I did I'll throughout the video I think I'll insert some clips of what I did, I didn't do too much because it's kind of self-explanatory. You get the color, you put conditioner in it. Let me know if you guys want in-depth tutorials on how I do this stuff, but I didn't need it. I just wanted to show you guys though, like the flow of the hair. Um, I didn't have to put any bleach to this or like, you know, bleach it because I didn't mess up the color. I just stuck to whatever color it was. Now, um, what I did was because I used so much conditioner, I didn't wash it with shampoo because um, there was really no point in it because I already had done it with conditioner and I feel like that's why it's so soft and flowy like what the heck this is silky anyways so <clears throat> over time when I wash it with shampoo I do believe that it will dilute and it will become more you know ashier and stuff like that so I'm looking forward to see that change um, but yeah that's pretty much it I love this hair it does shed a little bit you guys it does shed but like I said shedding with 613 hair and curly hair shedding with hair in general is inevitable and trust me I've been trying hair for about I've been wearing weave since like the fifth grade so trust me I know this um and I just I just feel like it's inevitable and we shouldn't stress about how much it sheds we should just keep it intact and just keep it looking good you know but I really like this hair so so much 
But yeah, you guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Thank you, Wiggins Hair, for inspiring me to, or letting me do this look on your hair. Um, Y'all see me do the Platinum Blonde 613, so I really wanted to bring color because I know you guys like seeing color. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think about this color. Give me some other color choices. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and follow me on all my social media. Love you. Mwah. Bye. Thank you.